Water, earth, fire, air. Long ago, the four nations lived together in harmony. Then, everything changed when the Fire Nation attacked. Isn't that such an iconic opening to a show? I love it. Hey yo, my name is Matt, and today we are going to be opening and reviewing these new Avatar The Last Airbender figures. So it's a completely new and different set, and they're all from McFarlane Toys. And I only got the four main characters. I know they also have an Appa. It looks pretty cool, but... I didn't get them yet. These are all measuring about four to five inches. I know there's another line, at least Aang, that's at least six to seven inches. Not sure if they have the others in that one. So just kind of looking at the packaging, I do really like it. Uh, seeing, even seeing this, even seeing this Nickelodeon logo on a toy, pretty nostalgic. From the outside even, I really like the figures. I feel like the design and the colors are awesome. The gang's all here. I was trying really hard to get Aang to stand, but I couldn't do it. I remember, oops. But I couldn't do it on his own. And I remember seeing someone else review him that there's something with his rounded feet. Might be a trick to it. Oh, yeah, how about this? Huzzah, got him. They all come with very little accessories. Whoa. Look at her finger. Is her finger supposed to be like that? Is it water bending? I do have some good articulation. It's really tight. I wasn't sure if I was gonna break it right here. Hard dress. Like she kind of brings it out of her pouch or something. Like that. We got brother from the same mother. He has a nice little like smirk, smug face. Same articulation. All of them do not have any ankle swivel or joints. So they got the ball joints in there. And his one accessory was the boomerang, which is also, also his uh, boomerang holder. I can see some good, good pose with this. Challenging. Our next guy is uh, Zuko. Prince, Zuko, or King. He got like these fire daggers. I do prefer his later in the series hair. Not this one, like after he cuts it off and he starts becoming good. Oh, spoiler. His boots are sharp. Once again, no ankle joints. I do, and I do like his outfit. It feels really stiff. Like everything's really stiff, but it looks cool. Like I really like the detail. Even his like undershirts seem like it's like cloth. And lastly, we have the avatar himself, Aang, the last airbender. His one accessory is his staff, which feels kind of flimsy considering how hard plastic everything else is. This is pretty soft and almost, on all these guys, the paint is really good. Like the eyes are cool. All right, well, real quick with him, I want to compare him to the Diamond Select one that I got a while ago. And at least this one can stand on his own feet, right? This quality is way better. And so just to compare it to that Hasbro Black Series, which I feel like that's a good height for like Aang. Like with Sokka, I can imagine him a little taller. Like assuming this guy's like, like assuming the trooper is like six feet. And Zuko. Oops. And then Zuko also. Zuko's almost there. I guess I imagine him a little bit taller. Of course, the comparison would not be complete without Charizard, which is pretty fitting for Zuko. Like for sure he would have a Charizard, right? That's pretty good. I like that, that scale. So for 10 bucks, I really like the quality. I can already imagine like a handful of individual shoots with them as well as like some cool combo shots. Make sure you follow my Instagram TikTok page at Amusing King for both of them. And uh, see if you see any of these guys on there. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.